South Korea's Future Frigate experimental program began in the 2010s with the Incheon class. It evolved into the Daegu class of the early 2020s and today's Chungnam class, which is now beginning to enter service. Construction on the Incheon class began in 2009. Work was divided between Hyundai Heavy Industries and STX, now K Shipbuilding. All six Incheon class frigates were commissioned between January 2013 and November 2016. They displaced 2,300 tons light in 3,250 fully loaded and are powered by combined diesel or gas propulsion with two gas turbines, two diesel engines, and two shafts, providing a top speed of 30 knots, a cruising speed of 18 knots, and a range of 4,500 nautical miles. The FFX has a hangar and flight deck for one helicopter, along with hull-mounted and towed array sonars and active electronically scanned array radar. Armament includes up to eight canister-launched SSM-700 KC Star, Hassong anti-ship missiles, and eight Haryong land attack missiles, one five-inch gun forward, one MK-15 phalanx block, one B close-in weapon system, CIWS, a RIM-116 RAM surface-to-air missile launcher, and two triple torpedo tubes. Construction next moved to the Daegu class. The eight FFX2 ships were built at Daewoo, now Hanwha Ocean, and Hyundai Heavy Industries shipyards and commissioned between March 2018 and October 2023. The FFX2 features more flexible and efficient combined diesel electric or gas propulsion with one gas turbine, four diesels, and two electric motors driving two shafts. At 400 feet, the Daegu frigates are 26 feet longer than the Incheon class and displace around 340 tons more fully loaded. The FFX2 frigates feature a South Korean designed KVLS 16 cell vertical launch system, housing a mix of Haryong land attack missiles, torpedo carrying Korean anti submarine rockets, and Haegong KSAAM missiles in quad packs for air defense. As with the Incheon, the Daegu class still retains canister-launched anti-ship missiles, a 5-inch gun, failing CIWS, torpedo tubes, AESA radar, towed and hull-mounted sonar, and a helicopter flight deck and hangar. Next in production came the six-ship FFX-3 Chungnam class. These are being built by Hyundai Heavy Industries, SK Ocean Plant Shipyards, and Hanwha Ocean Shipyards. The first FFX-3, the Chungnam, was delivered in December 2024, and a second frigate, the Gyeongbuk, was launched in June 2025. These are the largest FFX variants yet, displacing 4,300 tons fully loaded and measuring 423 feet long. Crew size has been reduced from 140 personnel for the Incheon and Daegu classes to 125 on board the Chungnam class. The FFX-3 shares many features with the FFX-2, incorporating hull-mounted and towed array sonars, KVLS and COD log propulsion, but FFX-3 will be fitted with a new South Korean-developed 7-barreled 30mm CIWS-2 and notably an integrated sensor mast housing a four-paneled AESA radar rather than the rotating AESA radars found on the previous FFX models. The FFX story does not end with the Chungnam. Work is already underway on the newest variant, the FFX-4, to be known as the Ulsan-class frigates once they enter service in the next decade.